Templates allow you to design consistent footers, headers, cover slides, or more, ensuring a uniformed look to all your mood boards. Let's first learn how to create a template. Creating a template follows the same process as creating a new mood board. Numerous designers initiate a new board named template. Just go to create from scratch and start crafting your new template. Feel free to incorporate any images you want into your template, such as your logo, lines, arrows, and more. You also have the option to include editable information like the project name and room. This information can be easily modified whenever you use the template to align with the specific project you are currently working on. When you're content with the template, you can proceed to save it. Simply click on Actions in the upper right corner and then choose Save as Template. Let's now see how to rename, edit, or delete a template. Renaming or deleting a template is very straightforward. Changing the name can be done by clicking on the title. You can delete the entire template by clicking Actions and then Delete. Alternatively, on your Mood Boards Overview page, hover over the template which you want to rename or delete. Three dots will appear in the upper right corner of the frame, giving you the option to rename and delete. We know things can change, which is why you have the option to edit a template once it's created. You might want to add some text, change the color scheme, or just tweak a few minor details. Whatever the case may be, editing existing templates in House Pro is quick and easy. Open the template you wish to edit by clicking Edit Template. Once the template is open, you will notice a badge saying Template in the upper right corner. This is your reminder that you are currently editing a template rather than a mood board related to a project. Click on any element to edit it or add new elements to your template. Once you are happy with your edits, the updated template can be used right away. Just go back to your project and start creating your next mood board. By the way, all edits that you make to your templates are automatically saved without the need to push any button. You will see a small note below your title letting you know that changes have been saved successfully together with a timestamp. Lastly, let's learn how to use a template. Once you have created one or more templates, you can use them as a starting point for creating a new mood board. All your templates are accessible in your projects under the Mood Boards tab. Next to the Create from Scratch button, you will see all your templates listed. Just pick the one you want to use, and everything saved in the template will be loaded. From there, you can make any desired edits and proceed with your design. We hope you're enjoying the House Pro Mood Boards feature. Let us know if you have any questions or feedback. Thanks for watching.